Oh, hey, you guys. So, um, in this video, uh, well, how do I get to it? I'll show you. Um, all right. Let's do this. Let's turn that off. Okay. Um, well, that's kind of crazy. I guess I'll go like this. Um, just a moment. Okay. All right, so let's say we have a drop down and we want to um, we want to uh, show other drop downs based on the choice that we make here. So let's say I have a I have a uh, company uh, doing a website for a company and they have stores in three states like California, Texas and Florida. Not every state. Maybe they're they're a pretty big company but not that big company. So a customer wants to find all the stores in Florida. Which cities? Okay, boom. So a new one comes up. All right, Miami, Orlando, Tampa, right? No, actually Texas. Okay, so then the, this drop-down menu here, this drop-down menu here will change based on choices here, right? Okay. All right, so how do we do that? All right, so let's see here. So first of all, okay, here, Oh, one thing you guys, I want to let you know, I want to let you know here, um, I am going to put the code for all of the files that I use in this video down below in the comments section. Okay, I, I'm sorry, there is someone, they're doing construction Okay, so it, the, the sound is not very good. And also I know some of the people who watch these videos, their native language is not English. So look in the comment section and I'm gonna put in some uh, links to the code. All right, so you can just copy and paste it. But I think you should be careful because um, uh, there was a change in jQuery or there is some kind of conflict and I'll show you I'll show you what I mean okay so here all right so there's a couple ways to do it here's the first way okay here's the first way we're gonna use the change function and the other way is we'll use on and then we'll supply this argument change okay well, let's just first use this one. In, in the newer versions of jQuery, your pe people, this is the one, uh, when I used the old version of jQuery, this worked, okay? But when I started using the new version, only this one would work, and this one did not, okay? Just let, just to let you know, all right? Or I mean this one here, I'm sorry, not, not the document ready function, I mean this change, as opposed to on change okay so you can see here uh, wait a minute yeah all right so let's do this let's do this here's a new version of jQuery right and we use on change all right so let's see here All right, we're gonna do, we're gonna try it again. All right, so that still works, right? But that will not work. That will not work when you use an older version of jQuery, like this one. This is a very new version, okay? All right, well, let's start from the beginning, all right? So what my code does is we have a first text box and it has an ID of state, all right, California, etc. So we detect its change, right? And I have three other drop downs one, California, two, three. 
All right. So, okay, Texas, display none. Display none. Display none. All right, so what do we do? Okay. And here we have the ID, right? So, I use jQuery to get the selected value of the state dropdown. I assign it to chosen state. And then I just have three conditionals, three condition, uh, conditional statements, right? Okay, they will test for, okay, if it's Texas, then I will display Texas and I will keep Florida with a display property of none. I'll keep California the same way. I know there's another way, to, I know there are other ways to do this, but when it's something simple, why not keep it simple, okay? Now, if it's Florida, display that one, etc. It's very straightforward, right? It's very straightforward. Um, and the difference, if you're using a very new version of jQuery, there's only one change, okay? Look very closely. It, this is the only change that will occur here, okay? you're going to supply this argument. Okay, it'll be on. That is the only change in the code in both of these, that's the only change, all right? And so I think you can understand how you could use this, okay? All right, all right, good enough.